So let's say that I'm at 21 feet. So this guy doesn't know that I'm attacking him. He's getting his bear claw from the 7-Eleven, thinking about his wife and thinking about the next time he's going to be able to watch Justified on TV and all this stuff. And all of a sudden, some guy goes like this. So he didn't have a lot of time to think about that. But yeah, he doesn't have time, especially if he's not thinking about it. And all of a sudden, somebody comes charging from him out of the blue while he's thinking about all this stuff, and he's carrying something, and he sees that, and he's going to go, what the hell is that? And then he's going to go, oh crap. Then he's got to say, okay, i got to drop this stuff, and i got to draw, and by that time, I mean, his head's off. So, there's no way. And, oh, and what I was going to say is, that's where people screw up the 21 foot rule is they go okay there's a 21 foot rule it says that a gun guy basically it says if we're at 21 feet the knife or sword guy and the gun guy are basically equal you can cover tw the average person can cover 21 feet in about 1.5 seconds and the gun guy can draw his gun in about 1.5 seconds okay where people totally misconstrue and screw up the idea and negate and just totally miss the point of the 21 foot rule is they turn it into a contest. So the gun guy gets there and he's all ready and he knows what's going to happen and all he has to do is draw and shoot straight forward. He already knows exactly what's going on. And that is not the idea of the 21 foot rule. The, 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 the idea of the 21 foot rule is you are surprised. You're not expecting it. You're just going out through your daily routine and all of a sudden there's a guy there and boom. You know, you don't, you're not expecting him to charge. When people do the drill, they're already expecting him to charge. They know exactly what's going to happen. In the real life, you don't necessarily know. You, well, you don't know that he's about to charge. Because, you know, people can give you little clues and you can be wary, but people don't say, okay, are you ready? Set. Hey, we're going to do this. Okay, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay, one, two, three. Uh -huh. So they get real confident when they do the 21 foot rule drill because they go, ah, I came out ahead. It's like, well, yeah, you already knew it was going to happen. So, so all the gun guys are going to say, oh, I can empty my clip into you before you get close. Yeah, it's not a contest, man. It's the idea that, <laughs> and, and besides, we're equal at that distance. All right. Well, it really starts with me. It doesn't start with anybody saying go. I'm the attacker. I get to decide. And so... Well, it's here like this. And you don't see nothing. And I'm here. And I'm just hanging out. And blah, blah, blah. Dee, 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 dee. We're at 21 feet. So when you're running, you can you can move the sword to have some kind of movement. You can move it like this, right? Show like that. You can run like this. Or you know I can do a florete here. Well actually I can do a florete and then have it. Here. Just because, you know. Or I can move it around just so that my might freak it out. Anyway, so I just run at the target. <laughs> <laughs>